pia tumekuja kuongea mambo ya GBV wa mama kupigwa hata wanaume wanapigwa watoto wanabakwa saa hii na sana sana ni kwa sababu ya ile stress tunajua watu wajazoeana kukaa kwa nyumba alafu ukikaa kwa nyumba bado wewe bibi na bwana hamjui mtaleta nini kwa meza watoto watakula nini so imeongezeka mambo ya hiyo GBV imeongezeka gender based violence imeongezeka na lakini tunaomba tunaomba watu wazoe kukaa pamoja na tunaomba mpaka makanisa na wale wazee wa elders wa communities watusaidie sana because hii GBV inatoka due because of stress na tukianza kutenganisha mafamilia saa hii na tuko na corona tutakuwa na shida zaidi kushinda hata ile tuko nayo saa hii so county we have the numbers for example in Kisumu where I got the numbers it was like an arise of 38% Kiambu I'm sure the figures are there the gender coordinator can tell us we have the figures and those figures are worrying us because those figures have become so huge that all the work we have done many years in this country dealing with gender based violence is being eroded because of corona so we have to be alert and that's the work of government to be alert so we have come to ask all forces to help us and of course the office of the county commissioner all the way the administration and the police to make sure that perpetrators are also arrested we don't need to only deal with the victim we also have to stop it so it is a it is a coordinated effort and we are sure that we will make some headway fears of gender to defend women she will never stop it it doesn't matter that is the work of our ministry it is actually part of our work signed on our work is to protect women to bring women into leadership to open up the space for women to even give women groups money it is our work so for as long as gender is under professor kobia she will speak